Catch me then you say Riding down 17, how about say my ride Shout out to DME TV. Shout out to Lloyd Gang family. Bunks the billion. Black Circle, Money Man. What got you in the management, bro? Uh, one, one day my cousin saw some little stuff to me and I, I, I pointed them to an open mic event was going on with Teen Zombie. Mm -hmm. Since then, he caught, kept me kind of interacting with it. And I yeah. didn't start liking it a little more. True, true, true. So how, 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 how has it been since you've been, uh, since you started it? Taking well, it serious, I say. You know, it's, it's, come, it's, come on, it's a little job, a little hassle here and there. But yeah. I'm, I'm getting to liking it, you know what I'm saying? Meeting people, networking, kind of what I like to do anyway. Yeah, so yeah. it's kind of coming along as a project I never thought of, so. Facts. I heard you mention uh, Black Circle and Money Man and them shit. Like, what, what's that relationship like? Um, I'm uh, kind of through uh, OG Pie. I know him. He's a Muslim brother of mine. I'm married to a good friend of mine, um, Esco. And you know, we were talking, collaborating, and stuff like that. And he's very, he likes Sausalino, the feel the vibe and stuff like that. We kick the vibe every time we go to the A and stuff like that. Yeah. So we're in the middle of trying to get some project working on that, basically. True, true, true. Let the fans know where you're from, man. I'm um, from uh, South Carolina, Merrill's in Right in a little small town outside of Myrtle Beach. Yeah. How, how, how has the process been with, uh, I guess coming into the management business and dealing with producers and, and engineers and DJs and studios and all that shit like that, like like how that process been for you? Well, I'm still working on some. Um, I'll be going to um, producer right there, Jam City right there, um, near the um, airport down out there, DC. Yeah. And I'm um, working with him pretty much right now with Social Nino and the family at this moment. How that process been? How, how did DC is a dunce, so I know, goddamn, he he getting y'all shit right. Yeah, you know yeah, I mean? yeah, he, yeah, yeah. He's amazing, man. That's what's he's up. Amazing, That's what's man. up. He's, he's amazing. What uh, what 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 big plans you got for MG, um, MSG, bro? Man, I'm trying to take this thing to another level, man. As soon as possible. Yeah. I mean, like I'm saying, I'm just grinding, slow grinding, trying to get up, working a little bit, and trying to find the right smooth sauces network. But yeah, yeah. You know what I'm saying? I'm working with Cookie 1600 at the same time. Ain't no just collaborating. You know what I'm saying? Hell uh, yeah. Cookie, cook, cook, Cookie bro, man. Talk, talk to me about Cookie, bro. Man, like I said, like you said, you got a lot of energy, man. You, know, you got a lot of energy. Came out with a little auto sauce, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. You know what I mean? And then, you know, they got a lot of energy, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, and then yeah. He liked working and then kind of in the sauce, you know, he said his vibe, kind of like the same thing. True, and I watch true. his energy, sauce, you know, energy. Like there's other uh, little autos out there right now, uh, Rich the Kid. Yeah. They got a lot of energy like him, I see running around. So I think it's gonna be a pretty good outcome. True, true, true. So will you see will you see MSG at in the next, I say year or two, probably like a year. Cause you got you got the talent. It's just getting the, the business side of it, I guess. You know what I'm saying? Getting all that shit down packed. Right, 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 right. So like in the next year, like what what do you see yourself at with this shit? Like And I hope I have it have it lock in a little bit better than what what, yeah. what I'm at right now. And uh I hope our name will be out there a little bit more by next year. Yeah, yeah. Stabilizing, yeah. moving around, and doing shows and moving around. That's what I'm trying to do. Uh, yeah. I'm trying to go around this thing global if I can. True, true, true. And, um, I, got a, I got a guy out there right now here in Texas to kind of work with, too, um, Ali. So, like I say, I'm just trying to work. I'm doing some work right now. Yeah, yeah. And uh, I'm trying to get it together. Facts. Just pay attention to the TV screen, line light. That's all I can tell you. Man. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let the fans know a little bit about you, man. I mean, like, I, I done heard of you, you know what I'm saying? Like, like I know what time it is and shit like that. So, like, for the people that don't know, you know what I'm saying? Like, like get them a little, uh, get them a little description of yourself, man. Well, pretty much I'm a uh, quiet person, trying to be laid back, you know what I'm saying? Trying to change my life around a little bit, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah. Went through something years ago, made some mistakes, you know what I'm saying? Just trying to do, do as well as well for me and my little daughter. Yeah. I got an eight-year-old little daughter, you know what I'm saying? I, I try to try to do right by her. Got full custody of herself, so that was pretty much what's going on. Trying to keep the circuit tight, positive energy. You yeah, know what I'm saying? yeah, I, yeah, yeah. I kind of outgrown a lot of stuff that I was into at one point in time. And uh, I believe in change. I believe in giving everybody the opportunity. So that's why I'm kind of sticking with um, Sauce Lino, LGF yeah, family, yeah. you know what I'm saying? Because they're from my area, from my hood. Yeah, yeah. And, um, 
it goes back to like you know, he got a lot of talent. Yeah, you know, this whole circle got a lot, a lot of talent, and I don't want to waste it to go through me or some other people went through. Yeah, so <clears throat> that's why I be trying to push him and give him more positive thought. You know, yeah. I feel like if I had people trying to give me ideas and push me like I'm trying to push them, mm -hmm. I might have a better outcome today. But you know, yeah. what I mean? it is yeah. what it is. You know what I mean? It is, I guess, a part of life. That's what I call it. You know what I mean? Hell Learning yeah. experience. Facts, facts, facts. A lot, a lot of the younger crowd need to get that in their head and shit, man. They out here goddamn bullshit and wasting a lot of time. Yes, you sir. know what I mean? Yes, and, and, and goddamn majority of them be talented as hell and they just don't got that, that person behind them pushing them and shit. You know what I mean? Right, right, So right. it's good that you out here doing that, keeping So Selena in the right direction because he... That boy Ben had it yes, a long sir. time, you know what I mean? He got it in him, man. His little family, family got it, man. Hell uh, yeah, so shit, that, that definitely, that's definitely an inspiration, you know what I mean? To see somebody out here who done, who done went through the bullshit, you know what I mean? And to come back and, and trying to change lives around, you know what I mean? So goddamn, uh, what we got coming up, man? Summertime about to be over, winter time coming up. We'll we need to put something together, man, try to goddamn do like a media day or something, yeah, uh, some, yeah, some yeah. type of networking situation and goddamn get all the artists out here and shit. <clears throat> Who else you got your eye on out here, man? It's a lot of talent floating around this goddamn 843. Yeah, yeah it's, a, it's a lot. It's a whole lot of talent right here in the Carolina. People sleeping on or yeah. not giving the opportunity, mm -hmm. you know? Um, like I said, my main goal is right now working on Soft Salino and then the Lloyd Gang family. But um, my eyes are open to opportunities and options and um, there's another guy out there out there that's not locked in yet. Yeah, but, you know, yeah. He's communicating, talking, working. Yeah. He go by Sway God. He um he actually out of South Carolina, but he live up there in Raleigh, North Carolina. Okay. okay. And um kind of work with well, I ain't actually working with him yet like that. Trying We're in to. the process and yeah. collaborating, you know, working and talking and stuff like that. Cool. And um a couple people, you know, hit me up in the DM. But um, ain't nothing went father yet, oh, yeah, you know what I'm yeah. saying? So but, um, that's my main goal at the moment. With the, with the music, how, how long you been doing it? About like almost a year now? Yeah, about, 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 about a, year? a year consistently, about two yeah. years so, you know, all together, but about a good year, year and a half. Yeah. Trying to work on it. Hell uh, yeah. All oh, you gotta just keep grinding, man. Keep grinding. Don't stop. You know what I'm saying? And goddamn, reach out. You reached out to me, so shit, that's that's like one of the biggest stepping stones you can do right now, you know what I mean? Yes, Cause sir, shit, yes, sir. I'm gonna put you in the right direction. Definitely gonna do that. Goddamn, uh, so we got Sosa, we got egg cooking. We need to goddamn, we need to do something, bro. We need to goddamn, we need to put together a little showcase or something. That's man. what I'm working on. We can do that. We yeah, can do that. Let's definitely um, do that. I'm in the making of right now, actually, uh, off of seven oh, uh, oh, my bad. Yeah, 707 Katie's Bar and Grill. Yeah. Um, I'm waiting on a date back. The lady said she won't give me a, um, a date out there. We can do an event okay. out there. Okay. So I ain't really put it out there too yet until I get the date. But, yeah. You know what I'm saying? Lord Game fans should have a show out there. And, you know, I'll invite a few more artists out there, whoever wants. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Out there like yeah. That. Probably uh, Team yeah. Zombie may come out there, uh, smoke the Taliban. Uh, probably Yard Gang, you know what I'm saying? I'll probably invite them. They're probably going to roster for show. Yeah, yeah, but, yeah. Um, on a later date, I'll put a note. You know what I'm saying? I don't want to put it too much out there right now. But it should be coming up, so just stay tuned. Bad, bad. Where you see Carolina hip hop at in the next year or two, man? Oh, man. It's coming up to go. Oh, to go. Well, that's a good question. I'll give it, I'll say, I, like I tell everyone, I believe in the next, like you said, two to three, five years, yeah. Carolina will be taking over. Facts. It's going to be like when hip hop hit it, Atlanta. Yeah, yeah, you yeah. You know what I'm saying? Because we're building up on here in the city right now. It's bringing in more, it's bringing in more uh, no people and everything at this moment. Yeah. And like I said, so much talent in the Carolina, people sleeping on, and not, not even open, open up the doors for you. But Fact. it's coming. You yeah. Know? So when it's coming, it's going gonna, it's gonna to come like a flood. Hell yeah. Hell yeah. But I see it on the map. I see it on the map in the next two, three years. Carolina will be the new wave. What's the importance of, uh, of getting out of your comfort zone? And taking and, and taking your music to these other cities and shit like that, and spotlighting yourself. I believe a lot of us, or well, a lot of artists, general people like us, yeah. we get caught in our zone. We get stuck in a rut. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? It just, I believe, I want to say it's the company. It just explodes. We never 
been exposed to other things. Yeah. You're scared to yeah. leave. Least scared to leave. You're scared to leave our little nest. And, and you're gonna have to move the network to other for people to see and to branch out. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? It's it's a risk. Yeah. You know, I take yeah. risks every day. Facts. You know what I'm saying? So but that's what you know what I mean. You just gotta break get out that comfort zone and just take the risk. That's what everybody keeps telling me. Yeah, uh, yeah. You know what I mean? Just like me, I'm scared to fail, you know what I mean? Yeah. So that's why I hesitate. Yeah. But you know, we got to fall to get up, you know, just like you got to crawl before you walk. With 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 managing artists and shit like like how how hard is it to keep them in the right direction and shit? You know what I'm saying? Like we, DME, we do we do an, um, artist management and, and development and shit like that too, and it's it's a struggle. You yes, know sir. what I mean? Yes, you know, and I ain't never talked to another manager to get their insight on it. So like, I wanted to ask you, like, like what's that? What's that? What's that process like for you? Keeping it's, them. It's, level headed it's, and shit. It's, it's, it's hard, but it's fair. You know what yeah, I'm saying? Yeah, yeah. But it, it's difficult, like I say, like I try to tell the few uh, Lloyd Gay family, I tell each one of them, we'll build our relationship one on one. Yeah. Like each individual is different. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? I might, I might talk to you one way, we yeah. come to an understanding, and talk to him to a different way to understand. Yeah, yeah. But it's hard. You just got to figure each individual yeah. out. Yeah. And, the personality and go with the flow with it like that. Fact. That's how I'm trying to do with it. You know what I'm saying? To work with my guys. Fact, fact, you know fact. what I'm saying? But like I said, it's not an easy task. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? But once y'all get a relationship, basically a communication relationship. Yeah. Once yeah. you build a relationship and communication, it'll kind of smooth work its way through. Right. You know yeah. what I'm saying? Fact, but fact, um, fact. It just, like you say, you just got to work with them and build a relationship with them. Man. Yeah. yeah. It's not easy. It's not hard. It just it just fail, I guess. You know, tedious. Yeah. Like you gotta you gotta pinpoint right, everybody. Right, right, right. You know what I'm yeah, uh, yeah. Because you know, what I'm like I try to tell my man to manage. I don't want nobody to figure I'm their father or boss yeah, or anything else. Definitely. 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 You just gotta get your point across. You know what I'm saying? Just get everybody understanding. Because just like I said, when we're coming up, mm -hmm. we we I might then see something that somebody was telling me. You know, what yeah. I'm saying they they not seen something. That I already see, see or may yeah, know. Yeah, exactly. So I'm trying to tell them in a different way. We prepare because this is what it is at the next level. Next exactly. Step. Exactly. Uh, yeah. Bet. Bet. Man, you know what I'm saying? What the fuck going on? I got a fucking rock. I got a fucking fucking nigga. Yeah, man. Bet. Bet. Shot my little dog, K dog, man. You already know what it is. You already know what it is. Right, right, right. B2BBC, you know what I'm saying? What you tired of? Solo Hancho, Flex, Gab, Cool. You know what I'm saying? B-Roy, you know what I'm saying? Pedigree Entertainment. Right, right, right.